Hey, this is Matt Reisinger with Reisinger Homes. Welcome to my video blog dedicated to building science and fine craftsmanship. I'm here at the 2014 International Builder Show and I'm coming to you from the Panasonic booth. I've been a Panasonic fan for years and Panasonic has a couple of new things that I wanted to show you this year that I've never seen before. The first one is this Whisper Green Select fan. First of all, this is a DC motor fan, so it's incredibly low amp draw. That's what I really like about this fan to begin with. And then of course a DC motor is going to last a lot longer than an AC motor. So this is a great fan to begin with. But this one's pretty unique. It has the ability to select the flow. We can pick 50, 80, or 110 on the CFMs right from the selector that comes with the fan. The other cool thing is this fan has the ability to plug and play and add a few other modules that add some selectable uh, features. Check this out. This module here is a timer module. So if you are turning this fan on, you can set it to run for somewhere between uh, zero and 60 minutes every time it would turn on. You can also select the CFMs, so it would run at a low CFM when it's off, potentially. And uh, along with that, there's a humidity sensor module that would plug in right here. And then there's also a motion sensor module that would plug in. So this one fan really can do a bunch of different things. The nice thing about that is once you install this fan, let's say if you had a three bath house, install the same fan, but a, a, a user later or a client rather later in one year or five years could change the functionality of the fan. Pretty neat new product. I really like this. Two other things I wanted to show you here at the Panasonic booth. This little guy here is pretty unique. I've never seen this before from a manufacturer. This is a transfer fan. This is a little whisper value fan that fits in a 2x4 wall cavity and it comes with this duct right here so that if you wanted to share air from one room, let's say if you're doing a house with all mini splits, if you're doing a, a passive house and you've got one mini split in one main room but you want to bring some conditioning to the other room, you can do a, a wall mounted fan like this. The duct work comes with this as well and it would blow straight into that other room. It's probably somewhere between a 50 and an 80 CFM fan. Very quiet as well. That's a great new product. And then lastly, I want to show you their, their Panasonic ERV. Excuse me one second, brother. This Panasonic ERV, you've seen me use this in a couple of times in my houses. This is not a new product this year. This has been out for about a year or so now. This is really a revolutionary new product. It's less than half, or really it's probably more like a fifth the cost of most ERVs in the marketplace. But what a great product. And at that price point, this is really bringing an ERV and really good indoor air quality to the masses. The reason why I don't like uh, ventilation only strategies is because if we're putting an exhaust fan on that's running all the time and we're just relying on natural airflow to bring in fresh air to the house, we have no idea where that air is coming from. It could be coming from the attic, it may be filtering through the fiberglass bass in your walls. We just can't control that. So we want to build tight and ventilate right. We want to build the tightest house we can. We want to do a blower door test to make sure that we build it tightly. And then with an ERV like this, this is a balanced system. So it's got two pipes, one that's bringing in fresh air and one that's exhausting stale air. So now even a super tight house is going to be able to have some fresh air. And this one has two settings. There's kind of a low setting for smaller houses and a higher setting for bigger houses. You can also change that seasonally. This is a really good product at an amazing price point. Thanks for joining everybody. We'll see you next time.